have a full e-learning module ready for upload to an LMS. This is the file that you hand off to your stakeholders so that their LMS administrator or project manager can upload it. For our project, to get familiar with uploading our course, we're going to use a test LMS called cloud.squorm.com. This is a site that you can use to test to see if your course works properly inside of an LMS environment. If your course works here, it means that it will pretty much work for any LMS. This site will help you get some familiarity on how to properly upload a SCORM file. Let's go ahead and upload. First, make sure to sign up for the free account. Then, log in. Once you're logged in, go to the top right and click Add Content. Next, click on the Import SCORM AICC link. Then, click Browse and find the zip file you published earlier. That is a SCORM file that you will be uploading. After you've found the file, click Import Course. We'll start uploading and then it will take you to the library section showing your module. This is the page that shows you data about your course. Once users start taking the course, the completion, success, score, total time information will all change. Since no one has taken this module yet, no data is showing. Click the launch button to preview the course. A new pop-up will appear and now you can begin to test to see that your course is again functioning properly. Once you exit, you are taken back to your page and you see some data now. To share your course, what you want to do is click the share button and choose invite. The public invitation means that the link will work for anyone with that particular link and you will be able to obtain data from all those users who took the module. Keep in mind we're using a free account so it is limited to a certain amount of registrations. If you plan on sharing this link, you may need to delete or archive the users who have taken the course. You can do this by clicking on the people tab.